Alright, so hello everyone, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VI Blindfolded LLG. So, uh, in this episode, time to take on Ultros. Unfortunately, I don't have a second rod for Strago, that would help out a bunch. But, I forgot to buy one in the other segment. So, I'm just gonna have to deal with it now. It's not really that big a deal. The second rod wouldn't help all that much. It would just mean he'd go down a tad faster. So, yeah. That's pretty much all there is to say about that. Vanish nullifies most of what he did, does, and of course, stop nullifies I uh, quite a bit as well. In fact, more so, really. The battles here can't do anything to my Vanish either, so... At least not the ones inside the cave, but I'm not going to be running out on the cliffside like a loon in this segment, so... Wow, I managed to get two fights in this room. That's just wasting time. Back attack, even better. I have the back guard de-equipped, obviously, considering it makes no difference. I mean, unless I get pincer attacked, that no, that would just be plain irritating. So yeah, it looks like uh, when I go down to the bottom and start walking down right here, then I, oh, I'm gonna go into that little notch, take one step left, and then go up to the top. But no, you just kind of get stopped here, so uh, that's a thing. Into the cutscene. Just because the people who made this segment decided that uh, I'd want to have a longer restart time every time I do this. Yeah, talking about the three statues and warring triad, card like that. I'm just waiting for an octopus to fall on the ceiling, because that's what usually happens after, like, big important conversations, just random octopus. The annoying thing about the ending here is that it's pretty much all luck. Pretty much just comes down to luck. if. It's not going my way, and I'm pretty much dead. I mean, that can be said for a lot of things, but... Okay. One thing that's nice is that Terra always gets her turn first, because of that text at the beginning, delaying until, uh... All the bars are at full, and then the character at the bottom gets to go, which is, of course, Terra. Nice, a proc right off the bat. Wow, I must say, the fact that I've gone three for three with those. The most important ones are obviously the ones from Strago, because they do like a thousand damage almost. Lock and Terra just kind of scratch him a bit if they proc, but... Wow, this might be the fastest KO yet out of all my runs. Alright, gotta listen now. Listen carefully. Well, I didn't need to listen as carefully as I thought I did, because, uh... It turns out I knocked him into the point where he's already using haste and protect on himself already. Alright, now stop him again. However, this may actually... He may end up actually getting an extra turn afterwards, simply because... Okay, that's Terra. I was getting confused for a second. Yeah, 
Yeah, he might end up getting an extra turn afterwards anyway, simply because uh, the haste and protect, I mean the protect and shell reduce the damage I do, and the haste obviously makes him wear off stop faster, so... Then again, with more procs like that, I should, I might be seeing Realm as soon as he uh, comes unglued again. Okay, have, definitely not seeing Realm. You should already be on the stop spell. You gotta remember that from last time. It's a handy bonus from having put the characters on the right cursor slot already. So yeah, someone got lodestoned. It took them off their vanish, but at this point it's starting to become an unimportant thing anyway. It's all down to Realm's sketch pretty much at this point. Theoretically, if I did this uh, perfectly, I could get out of this without doing the cutscene, I bet. But, I mean, I guess that's perfect. a waste of time here. Alright, so here's the pain in the butt part, because Realm doesn't like to sketch for Ultros very much. She's too low level to sketch consistently, so... gonna make sure I don't press too fast and start selecting commands or something because the first indication I have of uh, this cutscene being over is my turn popping up so if I press the button too fast all right so this can't be uh, realm this is Terra Please just die. Oh. Please tell me that wasn't Realm. Okay, it wasn't Realm. Wow, could I have a break here? That won't kill anyone. What am I going for? A record of how many times someone can sketch Ultros in a row without actually pulling it off? Yeah, and I think Realm just died. That's great. So... Phoenix down on Realm, so that I can hope to get something this time. All of you do stuff just in case you were actually Realm and I messed up. Nope, I'm just throwing away my morph now. And that was Realm 2. Unfortunately, Revert doesn't make a noise when I do it. Oh, wait. Come on, just do it. Yeah, I think he killed me. Or maybe not. Okay, finally! Wow, Realm, you really waited till the last second. Better than I can say for the first attempt, anyway. But now I'm probably going to have to throw the Phoenix Downs to heal my other characters because uh, I have no vanished characters left, I bet. Alright, so I think I'm still on equip. Skills item save. Items. Such a waste of cash. Whatever that'll do. 
I mean, considering I got two battles going there, the chance of me getting one going back is probably not that high. But, considering how bad the game was trolling me before, I don't think I'll take that chance. So, yay, more belt farming. I'd prefer to do as little of that as possible, but... There we go. Wine pulled off. You suck, Realm. For a second, I thought. For a second, I thought Terra cast a spell on herself too, but I might have just used morph anyway. But tentacle? Uh, no, I'm getting such luck. And here, it's just hoping that this works out. Well, that's not the middle. Uh, wow, well, this isn't going well at all. Oh, crud. Okay, so who is this? No one. I'm dead, aren't I? Okay, no, no. So I've still got straight on vanish. Phoenix down. The power of love for his granddaughter shall revive her. Actually, it's just kind of consumable that costs like almost no cash. Whatever. Oh, again? Well, at least the strike is not dead. But he could use a throwing stone at like any moment, so. Oh, he just missed Strago. Please have enough time to. Sheesh. Not gonna have Strago defend. Might as well have him. Found and ready. Might be dead. Okay, that lobestone must have hit Realm. Holy cow, this is really, really not going my way. I mean, I guess it could be worse, I could be dead, but still. How many sketches have I missed by now? I mean, I think Strago's dead, so this is probably curtains. Yep. I must have missed like 10 sketches there. Are the odds really that low? Sheesh.